So this is a day that we honestly thought would never come. My good old stage 2 2011 Skoda Lora TSI is now sold and that's thanks to TDH Classifieds. This beautiful car that aided us and aided the channel for almost two years is now going to a new home and unfortunately it's nowhere near where we stay or where we're based out of. I hope the new owner who is a very good doctor in Lucknow uh, enjoys the car to its full potential because this is one of the, I mean I've only owned two cars but definitely this is one of the nicest cars I've been driving and I've driven for so long. I've driven a bunch of cars for a lot of kilometers, M340i's, I've driven at least for 1500, 2000 kilometers. This thing I've driven, I bought this thing at 28,000 kilometers and now it's at 41,255 kilometers. So yeah, a lot of good memories with this and to be very honest, this car over here was our first proper build on the channel. Uh, we bought this car I think so two years ago uh, and we bought it and we just wanted we just wanted to do like a build with it. We, we weren't too sure as to what we wanted to do but we bought it, we took it to Niranjan uh, at Autodesir. He helped us a lot in terms of you know like guiding us as to where to go, what to do with the car, how to maintain it and all of that. And yeah, I mean, this is a car that I think so everyone in the team will for sure remember for a very long time because a lot of you viewers as well really love this car and you know it's created some amazing, amazing content for the channel. I remember when I had bought it, it was a very rainy day and you know, I had sold my Polo and I think so two weeks later I picked this up. Um, so yeah, this thing has, you know, given us some amazing memories. Uh, I mean, let's just go over the mods as to what all we have done. So, as you can see, we have these RS3 replica rims, Continental Sport Contact 5 tyres. If you open up the engine bay, that's where most of the work has been done. Audi R8 ignition coil packs, Piper Cross carbon fibre intake, uh, a full system exhaust including the downpipe from IES Performance. Uh, what else? NGK Iridium spark plugs. Uh, I have these Brembo brake pads and EBC brake pads at the rear, VRS spoiler. I have Cobra lowering springs, Miley dampers, uh, a lot of other things. I'm not too sure if I can remember all of them, but you know, I've kept this build fairly, you know, subtle. I wanted to look like a sleeper and I think so it has accomplished that mission. It's basically if you've seen the car on YouTube or if you've seen it in real life, then that's only when you know what this thing actually is. Some fond memories with the car is definitely participating in Valley Run. I've participated with this car two times in two different sort of configurations. First, it was kind of a half-baked stage two setup. And the second time was a proper, you know, thorough stage two build with the full system exhaust, you know, the lowering springs and everything. So yeah, it's put down some pretty impressive times. I remember during testing, you know, on a proper cold winter's night, it did a 14.8 with full interior, no hundred drawn map so you know definitely it's a very potent car in that sense in terms of the real power figures i'm not too sure i re haven't gotten a chance to take it to a dyno unfortunately but should be pushing somewhere around 230 to 235 horsepower realistically uh, it's just a very fun car to drive especially with the cobra lowering springs you know the turn-in of the car has improved so much the grip from the sc5 tires is amazing you know there wasn't there isn't a single moment where i didn't have any sort of confidence in the car i was always you know super confident that it'll just grip to the road and go where i wanted to and you have the six speed manual transmission which is a joy to you know roll through the gears and just the driving experience was absolutely amazing now the person who is supposed to pick up the car is actually going to Lucknow like I said so the transporter is coming I guess in some time to pick it up so you know a last couple of hours with the car this video is actually going to come out two three days after the car has already gone to Lucknow so uh, this is a little bit delayed in that sense but yeah it was a very quick process you know the new owner of the car you know he's super passionate about it he loves the car and you know he had no doubts as to this car was the car he wanted to get and i really thank him for that because he trusts me with the car he's not seen the car once but still he chose my car 
so some good memories was of course valley run uh, doing some ridiculous speeds like i mentioned in mexico city uh, another good memory was you know just after i built the car you know when it didn't have the exhaust spoiler or i don't remember if it had the lowering springs or not but i had taken it to bombay and i had you know organized this kind of little skoda meet up with autofly and all of those boys you know a bunch of really nicely done up skodas had come you know we were doing a skoda meet up at bombay coffee house then we went to i think so bandravoli sea link and over there we saw mercia lago i'll be very honest i haven't really taken this very far away like it's been only driven in maharashtra mumbai mahabaleshwar at the max so you know nothing crazy i've done with this car in that sense but in 2 years i've driven it 13 14000 kilometers which is okay all right i would say 7000 kilometers per year and some bad memories well not too bad and touch wood for the new owner as well that this car won't give him any sort of problems because it surely hasn't given me any sort of major problems because the only really 2 3 times that it actually gave me a problem was uh, when the clutch cylinders you know failed so this thing comes with two clutch cylinders basically which you know i guess distribute or manages the oil that goes to the clutch or something i'm not really an expert in that but it comes with two clutch cylinders one slave and one master so at that time one of the other clutch cylinders had failed and that was a little bit of a problem because i was literally going up a ghat and yeah it failed the clutch pedal went fully inside i couldn't do anything but luckily a tow truck was right behind me and he saw it he saw the opportunity towed my car all the way back to pune everything was fine you know just the clutch cylinders have failed one more instance where something else failed was when uh, last monsoon if i'm not wrong i was driving the car and i accidentally went through a little bit of a large puddle or a lake as i would say because you know pune you know it just gets flooded i don't know how and at that time i think so one of the uh, radiator fans had conked off basically that was not really that big of an issue again no major failures as such you know everything is sound in this car nothing really to worry about so yeah i hope the new owner enjoys the car let us know in the comments down below what do you think we should get as the next project car like the main project car on our channel which will replace this car so comment all of that down below uh, comment what you think of project lora and hopefully the new owner enjoys the car thank you so much for watching